When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. Welcome back to the channel. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining me today. What a bloody lovely day it is, and I'm in the van. So I've been out a few hours now, done a little bit more, just try and get in front, show you where we are. Um, yeah, I'm happy with what I've got done so far. Like I said in the last video, it seems to be two step forwards, three back. Um, but it's coming together slowly but surely. So today um, I'm looking at trying to get the bed sorted out. And once I've done that, and I've got the configuration of the bed absolutely how I want it, then I can start looking at the layout for the rest of the van. Are you where the kitchen is going to go? How much of a seating area I've got? There's not going to be a lot of room. I've got to say this is a big bed, and uh, it's pretty much a king size double. And the reason for that is, is that it's a monkey camper, and um, this whole van concept is about fitting two of these crazy little motorbikes in, and everything's got to fit around them because that's the whole idea of having this camper van as it's a monkey camper as I said um, and you'll be surprised how big a bloody monkey bike is um, I was even shocked I thought oh yeah it's no problem and the two little monkey bikes fit in the back of there loads of room but to be fair there's not um, the bed is going to be a king size bed purely to house the garage for the monkey bike but two monkey bikes will definitely fit in this garage the bed's going to be on a hinge system so I can lift the bed um, just to make it easier to get in. I'll put a doorway in the hatch there uh, just to make it easier to tie the fronts down. Uh, but yeah, it's coming together. Um, I'm even surprised myself because like I say, uh, I'm not a DIY man. A really big difference so the framework's done the uh, bed frame that'll be on a hinge just to make it easier to get the bikes in and out that's completed now um, get some slats for the bed tomorrow uh, look at mattresses um, still so much to do uh, I've got to finish the roof rack before I can start cutting holes in the ceiling and uh, putting the fan in and all the electrics and, and everything else that goes with a camper van build. Uh, the one thing I've learned is, damn, there's a lot of things to do. But I'm enjoying every minute. And, uh, you know, <laughs> thank you very much for coming along today. If you haven't done so already, subscribe, hit that button, give us a big thumbs up, helps with the algorithm, helps us grow. Buddy's still asleep on the front seat, bless him, so I'm bathing. 
and uh, he's been there most of the day. I might take it, he's still there, I've not heard him for a while. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much. On that note, we're out of here. Live your best life.